welcome to my world. Welcome to my world. This is Lexi, I'm Suzanne Ridgway, and welcome to my channel. It is just about 6 a.m. I'm going to show you what the house looks like before we start cleaning. And we're going to do some random things together. I don't have to do a deep clean, but a couple times a week, if one away at school. So I take advantage of that and make sure I do little things every single day so it gives you that clean feel. Recently did a list of 12 things that I do every single day, whether it be through a deep clean or the day after one, to keep the home nice and tidy and looking and feeling organized. And there's a lot to do within a household, even when you rent. If you're new, smash on that subscribe word. We do giveaways every 100 subscribers. We just gave away two gift cards. We gave away a gift card to Tina and as well as Lynn ate dogs, as in, I believe, having eight dogs, because it said deep after that. Not exactly a, the actual name, so we're really thrilled to make sure they get those gift cards. We like to have incentives to keep you interested within the channel and give away gift cards, because everybody could use a gift card these days with everything going through the roof. We're going to do a little tour. I'm going to show you what things look like first hand. Dinner table looks great. Nothing there. It looks like my kid had some snacks in the TV room. I'm excited that she used it. So later this morning, once she goes to school, I'll be putting stuff away. I'm going to get the backpack on the table. The laundry basket is never empty for more than five seconds. Jacqueline had a bath yesterday and I emptied the green one, which is clean. We got to invest in a new one. It's starting to break further. Bathroom. It will get cleaned today. Anything like this that's too wet will get hung dry. It gets a little puddle here, so I keep a cloth. I'll make my bed in a little while. Get the fan put back up against the wall. And I take care of my nightstand every single day and keep it organized. And I sweep every day. These floors are original to the house. And I keep them as clean as I can. Kitchen, I maintain all day long on a regular basis. And take care of some bottles. Clutter on the counter. Dishes to put away. And not much in the sink. It's Wednesday. Normally we would have Italian night and we froze last week's leftover sauce, so we'll be reheating that. We use our leftovers. The new shelving unit section that I put together is looking good. Garbage can was taken care of yesterday, but I'll wipe it down. Do a full sweep throughout. And I always take care of the stove top, the little counter over here. And wipe down the microwave. It gets used daily. And take care of the coffee. When I have leftover coffee, because my husband doesn't have it a couple times a week after he's had a couple of beers, I take that leftover coffee and I put it in a container. I like to make iced coffee, and I drink iced coffee all year, not just in the summer. Just like how my kids drink hot chocolate all year. I'm going to grab a bag of chips. For Jacqueline's lunch bag. She's into spicy. See if there's anything up here that she might want. Let me grab a chocolate milk bottle. They're non refrigerated, they're perfect. Over here, I'm going to grab a water bottle. Jacqueline's really picky, so I put a bunch of favorite things in it 
just so she eats. I'm going to make sure the lunch bag is emptied out from yesterday, which I don't think I did. Probably grab an Uncrustable and wipe it out. And then Friday, we're going to toss the lunch bag in the wash and let it air dry. I just found out we can wash these in the washing machine rather than just wipe them out. Need our chips, need our cookies, a couple of chocolate milks in there, and some crumbs at the bottom. You get this stump out, and then we're going to wipe it out and refill it. Wipe it out, and then Friday we're going to the laundry. Actually, Saturday, because next laundry day is Saturday, and we'll do laundry. Thursday now. I don't want to wash it until uh, the weekend here. We won't use it on the weekend. Yogurt Uncrustable. Chips. Sandwich. These go back into the pockets. I'm going to grab a couple of other treats for the morning. So we put in there an Uncrustable, a water bottle, spicy Doritos, yogurt tube, the chocolate milk, pop tarts, donut, and fruit rolls. Good enough. I'm going to throw in just a few Oreos. I'm going to try to find the Oreo dupes at Dollar Tree because I don't want to spend what Walmart charges. We only bought these for a treat. We had been doing lunch videos, but Jacqueline's just really particular these days. And I stopped doing them. We'll get the backpack up on the table. Lunch is ready. And goes downstairs in 50 minutes. I'm lucky that the bus stop is the same since kindergarten. And it will be the same all the way to 12th grade. One of the reasons why we chose this place where we live is because of the school district. It's top rated and they really work hard with children and the convenience of the school bus locations. Hello everybody, the rest of the video will be in fast play. We're going to make the bed. Just going to put something in my purse. Let's get the wire out of the way for my phone. Fluff the pillows up. And then I'm going to fluff out the blanket. And then fix the flap up at the top. Make sure everything is straightened. I don't use a flat sheet. Neither does Jacqueline or my son. My husband is the only one that does. On to the next room, the bathroom. I'm going to put a little bit of the Ajax in the sink and a little in the toilet. There's one more use out of that bottle. I'm going to make a note to check how many I have in stock before I purchase any more at the Dollar Tree. I don't like to go down too low on my overstock, just in case they're out of it for a while. Walmart does carry it for around a dollar, but it doesn't have as much as the Dollar Tree gives you. Now for the toilet, I'm going to use the brush and the bowl only in this outer part of the seat. There's a stain there, so make sure I scrub it and get rid of it. Around the rim of the area, the sides of the bowl, inside the bowl, it do a really good job. And I'm going to spray it down. It is LA Totally Awesome from Dollar Tree. You get the entire tank, including the handle, alongside of it. Then I'm going to do the floor. Just going to spray the floor a little bit and wipe it with the same cloth and then I'm going to drip dry the cloth and then throw it into the laundry for tomorrow. There's no need to really get a whole mop out because it is such a small area and the feet go directly down in the front and I just want to get it cleaned up because a lot of us are barefoot and don't wear socks in the house. Into the next room, I'm going to wash my hands first before we touch anything after cleaning the bathroom. Grabbing the recyclables for the empties bag and putting away some dishes, we're going to get things cleaned up. Getting things put away, I'm going to take care of some things on the lower view of the countertop. Get the blender put back together. 
And then we're going to get the pot holder picked up and the bread. I have my rag ready as well as my cleaner and go to the other side of the kitchen. I think we have a hawk nearby because the Blue Jay are very upset. I'm going to get the utensils put away and just declutter it a little bit. Unplug the coffee maker and let it cool down. I will save my coffee for later today. This is one of the days where my husband doesn't drink the coffee because he jammed last night and hung out, had a couple of beers. I'm going to get the microwave cleaned out and wash down for the day. Then the inside of the stove, the door there, as well as the oven to make sure there's no drips. Get the coffee maker moved out of the way. I'm going to pick up any kind of crumbs or sugar. And we're going to dump out the coffee filter go to the sink. I'm going to take care of the dishes now and get the sink cleaned out. Nice hot soapy water. The water should feel almost like a bee sting, but not burn you. Grab the frying pan, wash it down. And then we're going to take care of the Tupperware in here. I think that may be Tupperware or it could be a knockoff brand, not sure. And get the spatula. Jocko wanted a grilled cheese last night, so I made her one, a nice buttery one. And the cheese melted really nicely. Actually really proud of that grilled cheese because it doesn't always melt. And I made sure to do it a few minutes each side so it grilled up nicely and the cheese was all melted on the inside and it was golden brown. Back to the counter surfaces we're going to spray down this one. I haven't been using hot soapy water on it I've been using the cleaner. On to the garbage can the rag will wash down the garbage can and the lid get it put back on and just spray it down make sure it's clean and it will go into the laundry basket. And finally we'll sweep the floor in the kitchen and then go over the floors in the dining area before we're done cleaning and I got my cleaning done in about a half an hour before the bus even came this morning. And into the dining area once again. I'm going to get it swept up. Jacqueline's stuff is up on the tabletop ready to go. She'll get her coat on, brush her teeth and go down to the bus stop and then we'll do random other things throughout the day to keep the house tidy. Everything's ready to go downstairs. Jacqueline grab her coat when she goes. The floors are swept. I didn't need to do every single room. Jacqueline is actually neat and tidy. Just had to put them away. And the kitchen is taken care of. Those will drip dry. Counter surfaces. Floor. Garbage can. Coffee will cool down and I'll take care of it. I'll put away my cleaner. Microwave done. Sink taken care of. And the toilet's taken care of. The brush will drip dry. Didn't need to sweep in my bedroom. I just did it. I'm going to finish my coffee before I get rid of it. And then I'll wipe it down the nightstand. I did kind of tidy it up. And I made my bed. In about 25 minutes time, we swept, took care of the kitchen, the bathroom, and made my bed. And we got it done and ready for the day. And then once Jacqueline's out the door, I can go on to my next couple of videos that I will film for you guys. The giveaways, we do them every 100 subscribers. We're looking for 10 people to give out one gift card. We get those 10 people, we'll give out another one. If you're new, you need to comment in order to qualify, please be kind. You need to be subscribed and a United States resident. We're not responsible for any lost or stolen prizes by mail. All the information is listed down below what we give away. Gift cards are $10 amounts. We have a newsletter, if you're interested, email me, countryboots1268 at yahoo.com. Our social sites are linked down below with all of our playlists. Have a fantastic day. Congratulations to our winners. Don't forget to subscribe.